Hi, in this video we will see how to save a template file using Rhino Gold. So as you can see I'm using the default, um, default uh, Rhino Gold interface and now I want to change my background color. So right click on any of the tabs in the side panel and in here I can choose, uh, in this case I'm going to choose display tab. So as you can see now in the side panel I have an extra tab and now I can define for each display mode, in this case as you can see I'm on rendered display mode, I can define the settings for each display mode. So in this case instead of using the application settings I'm going to use a solid color. So I'm going to choose the solid color from the background and uh, in, in this case I have black but uh, let's say that instead of black of course I can choose any color uh, I'm going to define, uh, let's say, the light gray. Okay, so I just choose light gray, and as you can see now, the background color for all the different viewports are the light gray. Of course, remember that I'm on rendered display mode, and if I change from rendered to shaded display mode, of course, I go back to the to the original uh, color. So remember that it's important to do it for each view. So um, now I can do exactly the same. So I'm on uh, shaded display mode and instead of using application settings I'm going to choose solid color. And under the color option I can define, uh, in this case let, let me choose uh, for instance the um, black and once I click OK, as you can see, all the different viewports, uh, if they are in <coughs> shaded display mode, they will be black. If they are in rendered display mode, they uh, will be light gray. So remember, just you need to define on the side panel from the display options which color do you want for, in this case, for the background in, in, the <coughs> in the display mode. And as you can see, it's very easy. So. The idea now is to save this file for each time I open Rhino Gold, I have exactly the same template. So this is really easy. I go to Save, Menu File, Save As, and I'm going to choose the option Save As Template. Once I choose this option, it's really important to save on the correct uh, location. So as you can see by default, it will open the templates folder, but this is for Rhino interface. So I want to make sure I'm going to the Rhino Gold Templates folder instead of Rhino. So the location will be under the App Data, then Roaming, and in here I'm going to choose TDM Solutions, then I choose Rhino Gold, and in this case version 6.0, and as you can see now I am on the User folder, I'm going to choose the Templates folder, and in here I have different templates for each language. So uh, I'm using English, uh, so I'm going to choose, I have three different templates for English. I have the, the English, which is for light interface, I have the, the dark interface, and I have the elements interface. So in this case, should be only or the, or the first one or the second one, because I'm using Rhino Gold interface. Of course, the, the correct file will be the one, uh, in this case I'm going to choose the dark because I have the dark interface selected, the one that came by default. But remember if you change under the options to light, you choose the file English. In this case I'm going to replace by the English dark, save, and I need to make sure I want to replace it. And once I replace it, every time I open Rhino Gold, I will have my uh, background as I have defined it. So every time I open a new file, my uh, my uh, template will be the one I have saved it before. So remember to make sure you make this, uh, uh, you save the, the file in the correct location and this is the idea. So in this case, if you want to go back, you just need to reset your user folder. If you want to go back to the defaults, so this is the idea. Thanks for watching.